Spring break is in full swing for college students, but there is a danger that most kids and parents never think about. Hotel balconies. In fact, two spring breakers died after falling from a hotel balcony just last year. And our Lisa Guerrero headed to the beach to investigate. Bedlam on the beach. Binge drinking. Raunchy behavior and arrests. It can only mean one thing. Spring break is back. Spring break is going on full steam ahead here in South Padre, Texas. And I'm in the thick of it. This young girl had to be carried off by her friends. Let me ask you a serious question. Are you worried at all for your safety? I am worried about my safety. We don't take drinks from other guys. Anybody, we all have to stay together. But there's another danger hiding in plain sight many students don't think about. Balconies. Watch as these daredevils take dangerous leaps off them into the hotel pools below. Balconies may seem safe, and they usually are, but every year students are killed or injured falling off of them. Including this young woman, Narita Cruz. According to police, the 21-year-old spring breaker was perched up there on a seventh floor balcony when she slipped off and plummeted to her death. This is what we found when we checked what was going on at hotel balconies. We watched plenty of binge drinking. And this spring breaker was perched atop a balcony railing. During this out of control midnight pool party, we spotted these guys who were standing on chairs and tables way up there. We went to the ninth floor to try and talk to them, but they slammed the door in our face. You guys, we're from TV show. We want to talk to you. The spring breakers on this balcony were friendlier. None of us are going to, you know, climb on the balcony and do anything dumb. I've, I've had a friend, you know, halfway off the balcony, almost falling off, and I've had to grab them and uh, uh, be like, hey, man, like, you know, we can't be that dumb. With weeks of spring break still yet to come, let's hope the party stays fun and safe on the ground. It's estimated more than 50% of all college students head to warm weather destinations during spring break.